Hi, this is Mary Flower again. I got cut off, so I'm just going to have to finish this on a separate video. I got the uh, little tail ready, and uh, I'm going to put it through like so. Had to pause that for a minute. Sometimes I get these little, from the winter, little cracks in my my fingers. And so I had to take some skin tape off. So we have a little, uh, little thing here that works. A little thing here that works. Now they're not moving too much, but that's okay. We'll, we'll make it like that. Now I'm going to add some little buttons. And I still need to do the little glasses. So I want to find a place in here first. To put my little cat and we will finish it too together here I'm trying to think of a fun place to put this kitty I kind of like here her right here what do you guys think I kind of like that so I'm going to not glue down the uh, tail I'm just gonna glue all the other places and to be careful or to not glue around the brads. I leave plenty of room for those to be movable. Whoops. I just did a no-no right there. So. So what I'm going to do is put my little Fifi about like that. That way my little tail can move and she can rest it up here. She can move her little legs. Can you see this? Have I got it in the camera? So there's my little Fifi. And I'm going to pause it another second so I can find... The appropriate uh, paper for the cat eyes. So I've decided to use this paper that's uh, actually jelly plate printing. Let me find my, here it is right here. And this time I'm going to make it a little closer together. And I'm going to do something a little different to maybe get to the center of that. What I'm going to do is just go right down here because you won't see it anyway and just cut it out. Now I'm hoping that that will do the trick. Let's see if that works. Yes, that looks a little bit better, but it's still a little bit big right here. So I will glue it together. Let it dry and then cut it off. Then we're going to glue it down. Let's see if that's going to work. That's going to work a little better. So... There we go. I almost like I almost like that side better. What do you think? Let's see. Let's put it down there. Which do you like? That side or this side? Oh, I think I think I'm going to go with the the blue color. I kind of like that better. I'm glad I turned it over cuz I think it's brighter and prettier and maybe some blue jewels and I, th I think that I like that better now isn't that cute so my cat has some cat eye glasses and I'm going to give it a few jewels right here let's look and see what I have 
I think that I have some blue. Just a little bit of blue there. What do you guys think? There's Oh, here they go. I think this blue will be really pretty. So, I'm going to put them... You know what? When I was a little girl, I had really bad eyes. And the cat eye glasses were very, very popular. And I was so excited to get some... And they were blue, just like this. Some, uh... Now, hold on a minute. I'm feeling very uncoordinated, and it's just sticking to me. So... I'm going to stop this for a second so you don't see me fumble. Okay, now I got the jewels on, so I'm going to put a couple of these. Uh, oh, they're, they're not jewels. They're kind of just round little bubbles. And I'm going to use them right here for buttons. Now, I'm going to hold this closer, and I'll be putting in more detail on it. I don't know if you can see that, but I want to put just a little more detail on the glasses. So they show up just a little bit better. Okay. So, and then you can kind of draw on the cloth too if you're, you know, just kind of, it's not real easy, but, but I like to make it stand out a little bit too. Takes a little bit of effort, but that's okay. Okay, so here is my little Fifi. So this is one of the little, my little uh, cats in here. The little legs move, the little tail moves, and she has funny little cat eye glasses and I'm going to name her Fifi. So as you can see, I'm filling in these pages and while you're at it as a next step, you, you want to uh, go along and ink some of these edges. And I like to use this color, but it fell out. But I'll tell you what I did. It, it stains my fingers, but I do it anyway. I it, Because I have more control on it anyway. And I like to put this along the edges. And as you can see, this is an ink piece. And I figure it's going to run out soon anyway. So, And I'm going to buy another one. So I'm going to go around. And like I said, I love the color Cranberry. Um, you may like something else, as you can see what it does to me. Uh, but I also like to let the pages kind of stand out and try to give it a little bit of black around it too. Because then it just kind of pops. So, there we go. I've gotten several in here. Here's my little Fifi. Can't, I hope you can see it. And I've got a couple over here, and I've got quite a few more to go. I just really think these are cute. They look like little twins or something. And then I showed you the other one that was back here somewhere. Well, there's a couple more, but this one has just a little tail that moves. And I'll show that to you a little closer. And the the little sweater it's wearing, that's made out of felt. And I'm probably going to put a little... 
um, it'll be like he's looking out a window. So I'll probably paint like a window here and sitting on a ledge because I have a cat that does that. But see, you can see the colors are quite pretty. I uh, painted right here over this, which I will probably be doing over here and putting a great big cat that I've got over here in this area. So anyway, uh, sorry it had to turn out to be two videos, but you know, sometimes I flub up. And so uh, leave me a comment out on both of them if you wouldn't mind. And because they are connected, I'll just give them step five and six. So Anyway, uh, I hope that helped. I hope you can see kind of what I'm doing. Um, I've added a lot of uh, pictures to the other one. But let the cover dictate to you or choose a cover that inspires you. And then you can put funny things in it. So maybe we'll do a little bit more. Okay, you guys have a nice evening.